Hi guys, so today's video is going to be an unbox. Literally can't even talk. Hi guys, my name is MJ. For those of you who don't know, for those of you who do, welcome back to my channel once again. Today's video is going to be a video of me unboxing a popular brand of sandals. I actually went into the store to purchase one sandal and came out of the store purchasing another. So I'm going to review this sandal that I purchased and kind of review the sandal that I tried on and did not get. And hopefully it'll help you with your decision if you're trying to decide if this shoe is the shoe for you. So without further ado, let's get into the video guys. Be sure to follow me on social media. My Instagram is onlymj2 underscores. So I'll have it here for you and it's also in the description. So I'm sure when I said sandal that you probably already could have guessed what type of sandal I was talking about. So I went to Tory Birch and I purchased a pair of sandals. Um, the sandals that I initially went into the store to buy were the Miller sandals. I did a lot of searching online to see if they were comfortable. A lot of people said they were, some people said they weren't. Um, so I decided to go into the store and try them on. Um, needless to say, the shoe was comfortable, but it wasn't as comfortable as I needed it to be. Um, especially for paying 200 something dollars for a shoe because again like this shoe for a sandal is a big investment um, not a huge investment but it's still a lot of money especially if you're a college student like me um, trying to get through school so let's start off with the packaging this is the bag that um, they had at the store and it's so so cute I never would have thought of putting this lime green with the orange and blue how cute is that so um, this is what the bag looks like and I'm just gonna open it up and show you the box the box has a similar pattern on it as well and of course their logo Tory Burch logo um, so guys, let's get into this shoe, okay honey? Because these shoes are so cute. So with that being said, the shoe that I ended up getting was the Bryce Flat Thong Shoe and it is in a size nine. And the color is called Spark Gold. This color is so cute. At first I thought it was a little weird, but then when I tried it on, it looks amazing um, on my foot. And so this is a sandal that I got. Oh my God! Wow! So, um, yeah. So the shoe does kind of resemble the Miller sandal um, because of the small Tory um emblem right here on the front of the shoe but it's not quite the Miller so this the reason why I ended up purchasing this shoe was because of comfort both shoes are comfortable but these are way more comfortable than the Miller to me um, I have flatter feet so um, Having a flat shoe does not help me at all. It does not help my back. It doesn't help me in any sort of fashion. Um, so that is particularly why I got the shoe. But I typically wear a size nine. Um, and if the shoe runs a little large, I wear a size eight and a half. So um, yeah, in the other sandals in the store that I tried on, those sandals were actually smaller so they run smaller than um, these sandals do this sandal actually runs true to size to me um, for some people it may be different but to me they run true to size um, the cushion on it feels so much better than all the other shoes I can definitely say that um, and also this strap on the back just gives you a little bit more support with the shoe so that your foot isn't moving 
um, when you're walking or sliding or anything like that. Now, um, my experience with purchasing this shoe was not the best, but it ended up getting better um, over time while I was in the store. I can't say that. Um, but yeah, so this shoe retails for, I think, $1.99. I got it for a good price, so I got a discount. Um, and so I got it for a cheaper price than $1.99. But, you know, when you're buying a sandal um, for that much money, you definitely want to make sure that you try it on and make sure that it's comfortable and that it fits your foot perfectly because, you know, everybody has different feet and certain shoes will benefit your foot better than another shoe would. So this is a shoe that I bought. Um, I did like the Miller, but like I said, the shoe was a lot more comfortable to me personally than the Miller sandals. So, um, I hope you enjoyed this video. I also hope that this helps you if you're trying to decide on purchasing a Tory Burch sandal, if you have similar feet. Um, that sounds so weird, but if you have similar feet, then this will be the shoe for you. Um, I think this shoe is an older sandal, um, but they do still sell them. I didn't see it on the website, but I did see it in the store. And I also saw it on Nordstrom's website, um, and I saw it on Saks' website as well. So definitely get this shoe. I love this color. It's so beautiful. Even if you're getting another shoe from Tory Burch, this color is like just beautiful. Like. The camera does not do it any justice, but if you could just see how pretty this shoe is, like, oh my gosh, who do I think I am? But anyways, guys, I hope this video helped. These shoes are very comfortable, but I would not recommend walking miles and miles in them. This brand of shoe is definitely like a date night shoe or going out to dinner or lunch or whatever you want to do. But this is not like a wear all day shoe, um, walk the mall shoe. This is not the shoe, okay? So overall, I would definitely say that I love the shoe, love the brand. Um, I rate these a solid nine out of 10. Definitely will be purchasing another pair pretty soon. Um, and yeah, so if you guys have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them down below. I will answer them. I answer all of my comments. Um, also, be sure to subscribe to my channel if you're not already. And like this video. And remember, guys, that you only get one life, so you should always spread love.